welcome to my channel and if you are here for the first time i'm favor napoleon and you're watching the people's show on today's episode we're going to have an interesting time together ooh, 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 ooh. we're going to have a great time we're going to have a nice time together how are you guys doing at home we're all stay at home um i've lost count days i've run into weeks weeks i've run into months i'm praying i'm hopeful that months does not run into yes but let's be hopeful let's be prayerful this season because we know things are going to change soon we all are going to be free once again free 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 freedom of movement freedom of speech freedom of everything so let's be hopeful everything is going to bounce back to normal on today's episode i'm going to be talking about the gift that works so please don't go anywhere i'll be right back after this short break you are welcome back to my channel on today's episode i am going to be talking about gifts gifts that works you know i i i thought about this um topic and i felt oh this would be useful at this time to so many people i want to talk about the difference between job and work you know job is where you wake up every morning and you go to job is something so job is the place where your salary is fixed a place that if you don't meet some certain um, um, um policies there you might just be fired but your work is your gift your work is what you were called to do your work is what you actually you are actually supposed to live for your work is you you are supposed to become your work so what your work is your gift your work is your gift your job is not your gift your job you can be fired from your job but you cannot be fired from your your gift your gift is to make you stand out your your job is was actually designed to make you small to keep you in one place for a very long time they promote you in maybe in every four years or in every quarter or in every whichever company you work your gifts we sell we sell you out your gifts will make you stand out, which is your work it will make you stand out anywhere concentrate on your gifts concentrate on your work while you are at your job don't bury don't 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 bury your dream under your job <laughs> don't suffocate your dream or your gift rather they are both the same thing don't bury your gifts under your job don't suffocate your dreams your gifts under your job don't you work remember when you're working remember your work is your gift when you're working you are the greatest level of your assignment when you are using your gift you are fulfilling purpose you're fulfilling your assignments you know your work becomes you your work gives you it brings you so much fulfillment you become your work you become your gift so your work brings you so much satisfaction not your job and when you are working you are the greatest level of what you were created for you become a successful person when you actually find your gift you become a successful person when you actually find your work. Your, your job was, was, the system of this world is designed in a way that is supposed to make you small. Your job is actually designed to make you small. Your job is designed to make you a normal person. Your job is, is designed to cage you in one place for a very long time. But your gifts make you stand out. Just like right now, what is happening in the world today? Everybody is locked inside. Everybody is staying at home. No, most people. Let me say, not say everybody because some, some people still goes to work. So just like the medical practitioners and all those other people who their services are very relevant at this time still goes to work. So most people still are still at home, locked up in their home. But we just need one person or a group of person with a special gift. Who can find the solution to the to what is happening? Who can find solution for everybody to be released at home? 
to be released from their houses. So that's how important a gift is. If we find one medical practitioner that comes out now and say, oh, this is the solution to the problem, or this is the way we can avoid this problem, everybody is automatically free. So your gift is so important. Your gift will make way for you. Your gift will make way for the world. Your gift will make way for other, others. Your gift will be an answer to others. So your gift is very important. So ensure you work on your gift. Your gift is your work, not your job. I'm not against your job. The job is good. The job helps you to grow. The job helps you to gain experience. It helps you to have an experience. It helps you to know better and develop yourself. But while you are at your job, develop your gifts. While you are at your job, improve on your gifts. The job helps you too. It helps you to gain experience. It helps you, it motivates you. It makes you to have a lot of knowledge. But while you are at it, develop your gifts for example someone that is working right now you are you are you're at your job but your real gift your work is singing while you are going to that office to serve develop your singing your singing field develop your singing field practice singing go to places that you can work on your go to places don't just have bad on that gift and you focus on your job. No, you can do both together. While you are at your job, develop your gifts. Because the, the job helps you to gain experience. It helps you too. It makes you to know why, why you are at that job. Do your work. While you are at that job, invest in your work. While you are in that job, develop your work. Remember, your work is your gift, not your job. When you were coming to this health, you didn't come to the world with any job. You did not come to this health with any job. That's why people can be fired from their job. That's why people can be fired from their job. That's why people can be fired. Why? We didn't come to this health with our job. But you came to this world with your gifts. So invest in your gift, develop your gift, and no one can fire your gift. Nobody can fire your gift. You came to this world with your gifts. Great men will look for you when you work on your gifts. Great men will find you and pursue you when you developed your gifts. People will find you. I might probably, probably find you when you work on your gift. Your gift is very important. And when you have a gift, many people don't like you. <laughs> people won't like you. 90, 80% of people will like you. They will not even be interested in you, the person. All they will be interested in is your gift. Just like the doctors, we go to the hospitals every day. We look for lawyers. They don't look for us. You, that um, uh, uh, doctor, that person that is going to operate on you, or that is going to inject you. Maybe probably you are not feeling fine. You don't like the man's face. You don't even want to see the lady's face. But you appreciate the gift. Because you know by the time the person operates on you, you will feel better. Or by the time you are injected with that injection, you will definitely feel better. So that's how gift operates. Many people won't like you. But they will like your gifts. So develop your gift. So that kings and great men will look for you. Your gift is very 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 important let me ask you a question what is that unique thing about you what is that unique thing about you find it that unique thing about you that is your gift that unique thing about you is your gift don't just leave this health just you get a job and you pay bills, you pay for mortgages. That is not how to life. Enhance your gift and become your gift. Your gift is your significance. Your gift makes you important. If you want to be important in the world today, develop your gift. Master your gift. That's what makes you special. Your gift. And if you have a gift, you can succeed anywhere and everywhere. It doesn't matter the location that you are. 
If you have your gift and you develop your gift and you know your gift and you live your gift, you can succeed anywhere. No matter where you find yourself, you can succeed. Why? Because you cannot be fired. Your gift will always bring you out. Your job is fists. You know what you're supposed to get at the end of the month. And it enters your account. Bam! But your gift, which is your work, you can have as much as you want to have. It's just as far as your eyes and your mind can see, you can have it when it's your work. When you work on your gift, when you develop your gift. So don't joke with your gift. Don't play with your gift. Don't sleep and lie on your gift. Don't kill your gift. Bring out your gift. Let it come out. That unique thing about you is your gift. Don't kill it. Encourage it. Build it. Bring it out. That is what we're distinguishing in this world. The world is waiting for you. You become successful when you become a person of value. That's why I always advise, don't seek success. <laughs> don't be looking for success or be looking for money or all that. Be a person of value. Be a person of value. Study. Master your feed. If you have to learn, learn more. If you have to practice your feed, practice your feed. If you have to spend sleepless night to be a master in your profession, in whatever gift you have, do all you can to, be, to perfect it. Do all you can to master it. Don't seek success. Seek and, and, and be a person of value. You know, when you see the doctors, we don't, we don't, the doctors, they don't come to us. We go to them. The medical practitioners, which is the doctor, we go to them. They don't come to us. The lawyers, we go to them. They don't come to us. We look for them. We find them. Why? Because they spent years to master their feed. They spent years to specialize on their feed. So we are always running to them. Even when we don't like their face, we always go to them. So be a person of value. Be the kind of person that when you master your field, people can't do without you. People will find you. People will run to you. So be a person of value. Do your work. Do your gift. That is what you were born for. Your gift is important. Do all you can to work on your gift. Do all you can to do, 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 do I mean, do all you can to ensure you develop your gift. Your gift is your attraction. Your gift is what will distinguish you in the world today. Your gift is what will make a difference in the world today. Love your gift. Find your gift. Work on your gift. That thing, that unique thing about you is your gift. Bring it up. Let it out, you know. So your gift is very, very, very important. People will look for you. Money will look for you. Once you develop your gift and master your gift, your gift is your attraction. Your gift is your attraction. Once you master your gift, people will look for you. Great men will look for you. Everyone will look for you. I will look for you. Don't let your gift die. Don't go back with your gifts. God put it there. You have it. Don't go back with your gift. Don't leave this hurt with your gift. Sell it out. Give it out. Teach others your gift. Let them know your gift. Let the world enjoy your gift. I want to enjoy your gift. The whole world wants to enjoy your gifts. Let's know your gifts. Hope you enjoyed today's episode on my channel. Hope you enjoyed the today episode on People's Show and you have a great time. Man, I'm liking this vibe I'm having. Mm, 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 mm. Please, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. Subscribe and don't forget to press the notification button so that any time I upload any episode, you will be the first to know if you already subscribed. And please let me know what you think about this episode. Let me know what your opinions are about gifts. And I hope you are using your gifts. Now we have come to the end of this episode today. And promise me you're going to stay happy 
and see you in the next episode in the next episode bye oh.